Hey guys, Splatterpunk here. Uh, oh, okay, that's a little loud. One sec, guys. I am terribly sorry about that. But hey, it's always good. Uh, so yeah, we're pl we're back to we're back to playing Resident Evil. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, weekend's always a little busy, and I finally got time today. Uh, thought I'd do a little bit more work. All right, let's um. You know, last time I realized. I never properly checked the Book of Curses. Examine. Yeah. Okay, what the fuck is that? So. Alright, Book of Curses. The four masks. A mask that speaks no evil. A mask that smells no evil. Why would a mask smell? A mask that cannot speak, smell, or see evil. When all fall fall into place, evil will awaken. Okay, so what's the key we have now? Mansion key. Examine. There's an engraving of a sword. Oh my god, this was the sword key we were looking for before. The one I reason I couldn't go back over. Ugh. This is, I have to say I need to thank someone who sent me a message. I don't know who it was, or at least I can't remember off the top of my head. They were like, check the Book of Curses. I was like, okay, well, what's in the Book of Curses? It's locked, an emblem of a helmet. That's a helmet key. But I think the one in here is a sword key, I want to say. I'm not 100% sure if it is, but if it is. And I know Shambly McShambles is in there. Yeah! Yeah, now we can move forward. One sec, I want to try something. Nope, not Resident Evil. Oh, yep, here comes the, I remember this bit. And... Under there should be some handgun ammo, I hope. Yep. Now this is, like, this is the bit I remember. That I can't move. So, going in there. The shit I remember and the shit I don't is terrifying. the lock pick but well, let's check what's in here before I go down that way maybe I can find a save room bathroom ew full of dirty water remove the plug yes chances are zombie yep yep who called it That was actually a nice little setup there. I mean, it was obvious it was gonna be. Oh, oh, oh. Doesn't look like it's been serviced for a while. Of course I'll take the knife and you. That was it. I was hoping there was gonna be something like fantastical in there. But hey, a knife and a nice little cutscene of Jill stomping a guy's head in. I'm not gonna complain about that. Let's see what's in here. Oh, it's outside. Earth Basher. Hmm. I'll have to make a note of this room, but I'll come back later. Till for now, make a run for it because I know these guys are going to try jumping over that fence. Only because that's what zombies do. They're zombie dogs. So I will come back to that at a later date. And... 
Maybe there's something in here. This is the shotgun room, if I remember correctly. If I remember correctly. There are traces of something burnt here, an accurate smell for me, it's the air. Yeah, I can't carry that. But I can carry, I can pick up this knife. So, okay, my next priority is to find a save room. Cut, drop off all the spare shit I don't need anymore. Uh, buy, pick up that shotgun. Oh uh, no, get the, uh, get the shotgun, get all those herbs, bring them back to said save room. And then I can, uh... Let's see what's in here. Oh, fuck you. Duke you. And I think this is a save room. I. Fingers crossed, I hope it's a save room. Oh. Glorious save room noise. Oh, I love how they even animate the. They even animate the... Oh, that's nice. I dig that. Okay, so put that in there. Put, um... Put that in... Put that in there. What's this? Will you take the fuel canteen? Okay, let's find out what... What's the fuel canteen do? Examine. Fuel canteen. You can carry with you to light a f few times using a lighter. Oh, I see. Okay, that makes that makes some sense. All right. Oh, hey, there's ammo there. I'm not gonna spit at ammo. More ammo, the better, son. There's still plenty of kerosene left. Refill your canteen. All right. It's an old typewriter. If I had any grip, and I could save my progress. And I love how they they take the time to animate the uh, her lifting it up. Because so few games, you know, do that. At least the early ones, they didn't. Uh, let me take this. It's an old typewriter. You can save your progress. Use the ink ribbon. Yes. Yes, I will. Oh, God, I miss that typewriter noise so much. No, 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 I don't want to save twice. Okay, so what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to head back, grab those items, and then come back here, and then we'll have that handled. Uh, let me dump this save ribbon back in the, uh, in the box, because I don't need that for now. Ditto. Uh... Uh, I'll keep, keep that because I can make some super herbs once I'm there. Uh, and yeah, super herbs. I like super herbs. Super herbs. Actually, I can actually take this one. Oh, I forgot about you. I forgot about you. I'm an idiot. That's the way I came from. I really hope that's not like a one-way door kind of thing. So in here is where I can get the shotgun. Which, yeah, I need. Why do I need a shotgun? Because it's a fucking shotgun. Why would I, why would I deny a shotgun? Plus, it's, uh... Oh! Oh, hey, they ba base it off the, uh... 
That old turn of the century Winchester. I love those guns. Uh, I see they still do the stupid, uh, like holding it at your hip deal. I can't carry ink ribbons. But I can do this combined. And then carry it. Yes, I will take the ink ribbon now. And here's hoping it works like this. Because apparently you need to have a death trap for your shotgun. Oh, wait, no, I screwed that up. I didn't want to do that. Now I got to put the shotgun back. Guess what I'm gonna do again? I'm gonna take the shotgun because it resets that little trap. Why? Well, yep. If I wait a little bit, I do believe Barry comes in and saves me. No, he doesn't. I don't think he does. I don't think he does. He does not. Not by the looks of it. So, shit. I guess I will be putting that shotgun back. That or... Wait. Is that something on the couch there? No, that's just pre-rendered. So, alright. I'll have to come back for the shotgun at a later date. That's kind of disappointing. Because I remember in RE1, the Jill situation, which was the easier difficulty, had that happen. And if I remember correctly, back over here was where I could get the, the uh, aggro yacht stuff. Yes, I will take the chemical to use on plants. Right. Uh. Hmm. Oh shit! How did you get in here? Never mind. Not gonna question that. I don't want to leave all those herbs, but right now I can't really afford, you know. To leave those behind. But uh, I know the chemical to use on plants comes later. I mean, Resident Evil's not exactly original. They won't have a, like shit like that sitting around with no apparent use. Um, let's see here. Yeah, half of this is me just being confused. I do apologize, but I figured you guys would dig the, uh, you know, learning as we go. And just because I'm sick of your shit. And I got another gnat dagger. Yeah, yep. How much ammo did I use there? Uh, more than I wanted to. Oh well, there's nothing I can really do about that. I mean, I can. He's dead, so... Okay. Outside. Drop this. Actually, no. Take all that for a moment. Now I got to use... I'm gonna save my progress again. That way I don't have to retrack. It sucks about that shotgun, but I will come back for that. I mean, I got the ammo saved up here, and I know where this is, so... I will come back for that. Uh, there we go. 
And I know that like your ending is based a little bit on how fast you go and all that, but I'm not trying to get a specific ending. I'm just trying to beat the goddamn game because I've never beaten it. Let's see what this does. Use. Only find something to light it with. Oh, I need to find a lighter. Okay. Because I lack one. Oh, God, don't tell me that mouse has been there the entire time. I do apologize. If, if it has been, I apologize. I just noticed it right now. I've completely blanked on it, and if it's been there the whole time, I do apologize. All right, armor. I don't. I don't have armor. I don't need armor. <laughs> yes, I will take the red arm, and I will combine it with this. Oh, I can't do that with this one. All right, then I will combine it with one of you. Yes, and. By your powers combined. There we go. Mixed herbs. Examine. Mixed herbs. And make sure green and red herbs. Alright then. Let's see what's. A unlit fireplace. I don't have a lighter though. I need to get a lighter before I can do anything cool. Helmet. Alright then. Huh, huh. Again, I apologize for that mess. If it's been there, I'm terribly sorry. I didn't even know it was fucking there. There we go. I'm not gonna get... I'm not gonna get into a fight if I can avoid it. Avoid it. Hey, what's this? What's this? That's something. Wooden mount. Salmon. There's nothing unusual. Alright, well. That kind of startled me a little bit. I wasn't expecting that. Hey, what's this? Of course I'll take handgun ammo. Why wouldn't I? Alright, medical herbs. Well, guess what I can do? Now I can. And I don't know what that dog whistle is for. Oh! Well, hey, now I remember... Now I can use the lighter and fuel to light that fire. Find out what's in there. Find out what grand mystery awaits us. Hmm. All right, an unlit fireplace. Oh. There we go. Yes, I would love to take a map of the second floor mansion. Fantastic. People say what I do is useless. Oh, and hey, pick up these herbs while I'm at it. Go back down to that first floor, uh, save the, uh, drop off a bunch of crap, and then, uh, keep moving. On one hand, I'm both horrible at this game, but on the other hand, I'm shockingly, like, doing better than I kind of expect. Am I even have... Do I have room to get the... No, I don't think I can get the dog whistle thingy yet. But let's, uh... I've been told, uh... 
See, here's the thing. I haven't encountered one yet. But I've been told about Crimson Heads. I've been told they are a terrifying, horrible menace unto all, and it is best to deal with them in a extreme, psychotic fashion. About half of the kerosene room. Yes. About half of the kerosene. Yes. Alright. Now that I'm here, let's drop off the kerosene thing for now and the lighter for now. Uh, keep medical herbs and a handgun. I'll save my game again just in case. Uh, just because I really don't want to get caught losing it. If I'm sure some of you who are like watching this is are screaming at me, you're doing it all wrong. What's wrong with you? But you know, I I really never played. I've never I never played the HD version they did for the GameCube. I literally just played. I played the original PlayStation. This room's familiar. I can tell what this move, room is, but the whole thing about the Book of Curses and all that was all completely new to my ass. Uh, let's check the map. See what it... Second floor. The green are where I've been. Red is where there's still items, because I need to grab the... Uh, dog whistle, I think, is my next... My next, uh, grasp. Oh, uh, fuck you. I forgot about it. There we go. Oh, you have no no knob. Mm-hmm. Well, uh, I think that's it uh, for this video. I've already realized how long this video has gotten. So I will see you guys in a few minutes, and I'll continue on, and this will be a separate video. You guys take care. Bye.